I'll admit I'm not much of a gamer, but there are some folks that work with me that are gamers. And some of the game consoles are set up so that you could certainly play with somebody that's in your living room, but you can also play on the internet and you could play with somebody that's in Cleveland. Or you could play with somebody just across town. For people within Champaign-Urbana, well, let's, uh, Josh, are you number two? Uh, you're, uh, ah, Chris is number two. Chris lives actually in southwest Champaign. Josh lives in northeast Urbana. We'll say home one is here, home two is in Urbana. They're about to have an interactive little competition here where, Chris, you don't normally do too well in this, do you? No, I do not. All right, well, he doesn't, he, he's such a hard worker, he doesn't have time to play games at night. I don't know what that says about Josh, but. <laughs> uh, is it behaving itself? Yeah. It's getting set up. It takes a second to get it set up. You have to invite people, and you can have more than two people. I think you can have multiples on these games. And they're gonna be able to have an interactive road race Actually, you're seeing it better than I am. Um, pretty quick. Because the connectivity between them has very low latency and very high speeds, this should be just as good as if they were in your, both in the same room in the living room, except each one of them gets their own custom view of the track. There's still a, here we go. Hold on to your hats. Who's winning? <laughs> I know who we should have playing this game. <laughs> One of the other things these game consoles have, and whether these are Wii's, but these could be Xboxes, these could be PlayStations, they also have Netflix. They also have internet browsers. They can even do email these days across them. There's lots of things you can do just with a game console. And if you've got a game console, you don't have to have a computer to take advantage of some of the internet-based things. It's all moving online, and the difference between your DVD player and your game console is a lot less than it once used to be.